Okay, now it's time to draw a pictorial representation of these numbers of apples in base 5. We have first 1, 0, base 5. So let's start drawing some apples. My secret weapon for drawing apples is these Crayola markers because it's much easier than making squigglies. Let's start counting. 1, 2, 3, 4, and then what's after 4, Ariel? 1, 0, base 5. 1, 0, base 5, because now we bundle that group. And we've got 1, 0, base 5 apples. I know my little green dots don't really look like apples, and some of yours will be perfect, beautiful apples that look edible, but I'm not patient enough to do that, so my apples are really just green dots. Okay. That one was easy, Karen. Yep. Let's do the next one. One, two, base five. What color should I use for the one? I think you should use blue so that it matches up perfectly. Because the blue is our representation for the five's place, yeah. not the one's place, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. So here we are really digging apart at what place value means. The fact that the one is in this place in base 5 means that we have one 5 and the 2 in this place means that we have 2 units. So I'm going to use my magic apple drawing tool because I'm not patient enough to draw apples and we're going to count. We've got one apple, two apples, three apples, four apples, one zero base, base five. five apples, but we don't need one zero base five. What do we need? We need one two base five. One two base five. So let's keep going with our Granny Smith green apples. Okay. So we've got one zero, one, 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 one two. two. Bam, we just drew one two base five apples. Awesome, love it. Or dots. Okay, two, three. I'm going to go faster on this one, or do you want to do this one? I don't care. Okay, I'll go faster. Let's do two two, three, base five. So we need two groups of five. So let's do that really quick. One, two, three, four, boop. One, zero. One, two, three, four, boop. No sound effects really needed. Yeah, two, I zero. <laughs> Maybe your apples don't. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so here we have two zero, two one, two two, two three. They got bigger, but it's okay. Yeah, I want those apples. You want the I bigger get apples? Get I'll get that little teeny one. Okay. okay. So the next one's going to take a little bit of time and patience, but the magic fast fat dot maker will help a lot. So the next one was one zero three. So that means that we have three single apples. Zero groups of five apples that aren't accounted for, and one group of 25 apples. You know, Karen, I think mm -hmm. that this one is really tricky because before, when I was looking at the ones, mm -hmm. I was able to tell just how many little apples I needed to draw. But here, when you look at the ones, it's a zero, so you feel like you shouldn't draw any at all. Well, that's the fives. Yes. That's what I meant. Okay. So you feel like you shouldn't draw any at all? Yeah. Well, let's just start drawing apples and see what happens. Okay. Is that okay? I mean, yeah. can't hurt. So. You're in charge here. Oh, okay. Well, let's go. All right. So, one, zero, three, base five. Let's just start going and count. One, one two, two, three, three four. four one zero, base one five. zero. Okay, let's keep going because we're not big enough yet. It's definitely okay. a bigger number. I trust you. Okay. One, two, three, four. One zero, base five. One, 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 two, two, one, three, one, four, two, two zero, zero, base five. So we're going to keep going because it's not a big enough number yet. Okay, okay. So. Two, one, two, 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 two three, two, four, three, zero. three, zero. Awesome. Okay, three, zero, base five. So three, 
three one, three two, three three, three four, four zero. Because we've got four bundles of five. I'm starting to think you're lying. All I see is zero. Okay. Let's keep going. Okay. So we've got four bundles of five. Four zero base five. Four one, four two, four three, four four. Oh, okay, so now we have a five. We've, but we're not allowed to have five because there's no five. Oh. There's not a digit that's called five. So that, okay, so now we're going to circle up the pink because it's yep. a one group of S 25. So now we're going to do this super, super bundle, the bundle of bundles. It's huge. It's like a whole crate of apples. Yes, it's like a case or something. I don't know how apples are sold. I think they're in bushels, but that's a whole other story. Okay. So, All right, so, so far we've drawn one zero zero. Yeah. From our place value chart, which mine has stuff in it, but um, we can really quickly go over here. So right now we've got, this would be our ones, this would be our fives, and this would be our 25s. Okay. So, so far we have one thing, or one big mega bundle in the 25s place because we've counted all the ones and moved them over to the fives and moving them over to the 25. But we're not at one, zero, three yet. Okay. We're at one, nothing, nothing. So how many more apples do we need? Well, we don't need any more bundles of five. Right, so we shouldn't actually draw five more. Okay, so we should draw three. Just three more. One, two, three. So we've got our five bundles of five that became that one, one. Mm -hmm. and then we've got three single apples which right. goes here and since we don't have any bundles of five that's what goes zero. in that five. place value mm -hmm. the place value chart helps a lot of kids some teachers use envelopes some teachers use other things but they always first start by counting with bundling and then they do the pictorial worksheets okay so can you remind me one more time, why we don't say 103 base 5? Because it's not 103, because 100 is a number that exists in base 10. Because it means 100, and 100 is 10 groups of 10. And here we have 5 groups of 5. Okay. So whatever base it is, is the way that you group things. In base 10, you... You group ten ones and then ten tens and then oh. ten oh. hundreds and that's how your place values go up in base ten. So in base five, you group five ones, mm -hmm. five fives, yep, five twenty fives. And then what do we get if we have if we have five twenty fives? That's the next oh, place would value it be over. Twenty five. No, it would be one twenty five. Uh huh. One twenty five because it's just like money. Five pennies is a nickel. Okay. Five nickels is a quarter, okay. and five quarters is a dollar twenty-five. So I get it. you bundle in groups of five. Great. Okay. So, all right. Hope this helps with your homework and your quiz that's upcoming.